Hello guys, this is me, Motocross Lover here today, and I am bringing you a how-to video, and I am going, if you're wondering why, Logman Hamachi is up on the screen. Um, it is because this is what I'm going to show you how to install. It is the tutorial on how to install Hamachi, Logman Hamachi, for some of you people out there that don't know how. Um, so... Uh, so what you're gonna do is my friend JT Rose, um, is Minecraft, um, Taco, and he, he's a good friend of mine, um, so, uh, you should type in yes, <laughs> he's in this call, but, um, he muted his mic for some odd reason, don't know why, but let's go ahead and get started, he'll probably join us with us later, talking. Yeah, I, I know, I know, put that, I, on no, yeah, I know, so, now, you got your, um, now, uh, you go to your web browser, and you type in, I'll put this link in the description, but you type in log, log me in, log me in com. it should take you straight to this page, it should, in, or something like this, you go to download but if you want to download this you go you click this then you click download if you have windows if you have windows you click that if you have mac you use that but i'm just going to go through this again right through here just going to go through this right here and then open it just going to open it it says Windows Installer and da, da 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 If you, whatever language you have, go ahead and click it. I have English, so I'm not going to change it. Then you're just going to go ahead and click it. And then it's copyright, da, 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 log me in Hamachi. It's a free program. It'll allow you to do just about whatever you want to do, but what it's mostly for, creating servers. So now you just want to do that. Uninstall, no. Reinstall, I'm just going to reinstall com current version. So reinstall. And that it's gonna. On, sorry about that. It's gonna come up with a little thing for Windows. You know, if you, it's a little pop up and stuff. So I'm just gonna let it do that, and it's gonna finish it. Then let's go back back to the desktop, and you're just gonna get this little icon. But your little icon is going to be like this. It's not gonna have the IP or nothing. It's probably gonna say your name and something like that. You're just gonna click this, and it's gonna create all your stuff and things like that and it'll not that it'll become up to your name and your then you got your IP and um now if you like you say you want to create a new what network go to create a new network join existing networks basically how you see I have five of five well that's how much you can hold you can only have five people on at a time then you gotta create another one then do that but if you want multiple people on here you just gotta create another one join it let them join and da, 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 da. and it's it's a really easy thing to use and learn and stuff. It's really good for private servers instead of port forwarding. Only thing I have to really do is just use this and that and use this IP. That's what basically log me and how much is for. It is for um letting you download stuff really. It really helps out a lot. Um excuse me for that. I'm wondering where um, taco went. Colors, t coloring taco. I wonder where he went. So, um, so thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe, comment, rate, and enjoy.